Okay, hello there, Libras here. I'm going to, I said, oh, I got to stop doing that. I'm scaring you guys. Okay, Libras, I'm going to do um, your psychic oracles here. Just a second. I got, I to turn the heat off. Hello there, Libras. I'm going to see what vibe I'm getting from you guys. I feel like you guys are a little distant from someone. You're not talking to them. And I think it was just some misunderstanding. Okay. Um, yours is always a misunderstanding. Because I think you don't blurt out too much. Like some people, they, ah, you're not like that. You would get like that, but it's like you don't talk too much. You like forget it. You just don't want to talk. You just go away. And that's why they don't understand you because you're not explaining because you don't want it to turn into an argument. That's why your retrograde in the months to come is about communication. Everyone seems like it's about a communication because no one's talking because you know why? Everyone's on here. Everyone's not on YouTube. I'm not talking about YouTube. I'm talking about just on social media in general. Or they're watching some editorial or they're talking to someone outside of their home and everyone's doing that. That's why I want to do that world talk um, about stuff, okay? Libra, let's see what we got. Oh, yeah, look. And I just said that. Look what popped out. Communication. Yep, I just said that. I feel like you are two lovebirds, whoever you guys are. I bit my tongue. <laughs> you guys are two lovebirds, Libra. I'm going to say this. You might get mad at me, but what are you going to do? <laughs> Just kidding. I feel like whoever this person that you're dealing with, you knew how they were from the get-go. I don't know what you thought they were going to turn into a flower. I'm not saying they're a mean person, but you knew how they were. So I don't know why did you get with this person. You need to look back at what made you combine with this person here. Because you feel like this is brand new to you, what's going on. Okay? You probably thought... They weren't going to say anything. Because a lot of people think when they're with someone for a long time, oh, that's not going to happen. Oh, they're not going to do that. And then it happens. It's like, I can't believe this. Believe it or not. You know why I said that? Because when you're with someone for a long time, people change. Whether it's bad or good, they could be having experiences outside of the home. Like they go out and they have some kind of episode with someone. And they start thinking about life different. Sometimes that happens. And then they start going back to their past and thinking. And you're like, what's wrong with them? You got to think about that. Because I know you like glorifying things. You like harmonizing things. And that will, that's what Libras are about. But you got to think about the other person. They're not a Libra unless they are. Yep, emotionally withdrawn. This is what you're doing right now, probably from your person here because no one's talking. Because you're scared of your, t not scared, but you know if you're taught, something's going to blurt out like that because that's probably how they are and you went to yourself here. But when you go to yourself, your person is thinking about it. Is he or she thinking about someone else or they think about leaving because you're not talking? And they don't understand. You just want to take a breather. That's why I said when people get with people, they need to know how these people are, how the conversation is about. Yeah, and this can reverse balance. There needs to be some balance. You keep getting this here. You've been getting this for a long time since I read you balancing in the home. Because I feel like you're okay outside of the home. It's like you go talk to friends or um, someone you're close to. But when it's come to your home, it's different. Because... Most of your activity is outside of the home because you like being around people and helping people out in your home. Well, you know you're going to take care of that, but this person is not getting it. They don't get how you operate. It's like they're trying to change it too. I don't know why all these uh, air signs. That's because your air sign. You want to blast out who you are. Let's do this. Let's do that. That's that air going out there. And you want it to flow. That's why they call you guys air signs. Bring some balance back to your home, okay? And it's going to work itself out. Yep. And you need some rest here because this is you're not getting rest with this tension going on. Ever since I've read you for three years, it's been eggshells. Boop, normal eggshells. Boop, walking on eggshells. Boop, normal. When you I feel like when you guys go out or whatever you do, you guys don't look at each other or talk about things because you think something's going to blurt out and you're going to get embarrassed. You guys take care of your home life here. Something's not being nurtured. 
you're going to get out of this because you're going to start talking to people you're going to sit to yourself. That's why it's good to get rest here and withdraw yourself from certain things. But just I hope your mate understands when you say, I just need some time to myself. But some people don't understand it. Oh, you just want to go talk to someone on the phone. But some people don't understand stuff like that. Okay? You're going to get through this with the right people and the right conversation. Because I feel like people can feel your heart. They know how you are. They know you're a good person. And some things, you got to work together. If there are things going on in the home or something that needs to be changed or something, you guys need to talk about it. Not talk at each other like that. Because I feel like that's what's probably going on. This is disconnect and boredom here. I feel like you like dealing with your situations by yourself. You probably talk to certain people, but you don't like telling too much. And you keep the harsh stuff to yourself. And that's what makes it hard. Like if there were name calling and things like that, that's the part you keep to yourself. And it's hard. I know names hurt. We all remember that in elementary school. Remember sticks and stones, they break my bones, but names would never hurt. Yeah, names does hurt. They do hurt. You know that's not you. You know you're not that. Okay? So don't think like that. Don't feel like that. Don't feel like you have to compete with anyone. You don't have to do that either, Libra. All right? You know who you are. You know who you are. And this is heartache and loss. You didn't lose anything. That person is not going anywhere. And I know you feel like you're going to give up and you're tired, but don't hold on to names and things. I'm sure our parents said stuff under their breath about us, okay, and our own best friends. Sometimes we get angry. I can't stand it. They don't mean it. But don't let that ruin anything for you. That's weird. I was thinking about that person this morning. I haven't seen him in a while. I don't mean to put that in your read, but you're going to be okay. Don't put... Look at you. Look how this, this is not all of you. Look at this. Withdraw. Don't do this. Don't keep doing that to yourself, okay? You don't have to do that. You're doing a good job with stuff. Yep, solitude. Going to yourself again. You're probably folding up because you don't want things to get worse, and I don't blame you. But like I said, people get with people and they know how they are when they first meet them. They're not going to change just because you've got all this lavish um, material stuff. If they like things a certain way, if they were raised a certain way, they had a certain experience in their life and you didn't, what do you think is going to happen? It's going to come up in a subject or something that's going on in the home. And you have the right and the choice to say, I don't want to deal with you because I don't like what's going on or I... I'm not telling you guys what to do. Yep, choose wisely. And I'm just talking about that now. Choose wisely next time about your decision. Now, if you're married to someone, you guys need to go to marriage counseling or do something different about your situations here. People in these relationships. Just a second. All right, Libra, I had to take a little break here. All right? Yeah. You gotta, you gotta be, because I'm gonna tell you something else. When you go into that solitude mode, when you withdraw, you start having those thoughts. So be careful with your thoughts too, what you're thinking about here. Yep, everyone's getting this card. Your destin, your destination is your legacy. Your legacy was your family and what you put together. That's what your legacy is. I'm sorry, I had to take care of something. Okay. It's your family. It's your friends. It's what you created. It's your legacy. That's what it is. That's what it's about. All right? And this is patience and planning. Just have patience with things here. And if you do have a mate that's up in the air with things, make sure you guys... You guys can't keep not... It's like you guys come back together in a strange way. No one still has talked about what the deep-rooted problem is. No one hasn't. Um, no one hasn't talked about. And this material and spiritual prosperity here. Now it's all about peace and love. Now, at first it was about the material and the traveling and doing this here. Now it's about love and peace here because you're getting tired. 
You can buy all the material things in the world and things are still like this in the dark. You want that peace and that love so you can feel good about things and feel good about that because that material stuff, it's just, it's almost like echoing and getting dusty. You want peace and love? This is what you want to bring back into your situation here, Libra. Okay? And that's what we're going to work on. Okay? That's what we're going to work on. That's what you're going to want for this year. All right? And it, for it to go on and on and on here. It's not about who's right and who's wrong. It's just balancing out the whole situation here. Maybe, I don't like giving people advice and I really can't, but maybe some counseling or something can help, you know, or whatever, and stuff like that. You know, some people do that and they say it's a good thing to do that. Then, you know, be professionally counseled and stuff. Some people say that's a good idea. So try that here. All right, leave it you guys. Thanks for watching. You guys be good. Be good. <laughs> like E.T. said, be good. Okay? All right. I'll see you guys soon. Bye and thanks for watching. Bye now.